Family Travelers. My name is Karen and I am your seasoned airport agent and uh, the other day I was uh, coming home from a trip and they gate checked my bag. So normally I always carry and as you know if you travel at all towards the end they run out of space and they're going to gate check your bag. Uh, which they did. So and uh, it was fine. It was fine. I, I tagged it myself because obviously I'm a gate agent. I know what I, you know what needs to be done. I had the tag. But I just kind of want to go over some things if your bag gets checked at the gate and some things that you might want to consider. Number one, always put your name on a bag. Always. Have, have your name tag on it. If they gate check your bag, uh, make sure it is going to your final destination. Like if you're connecting in a city, Make sure that the agent knows that you are connecting, especially if they are handwritten tags, because sometimes that's what they do. Make sure you know what your connecting ticket is, where, what city you're going to, and the flight number, because that will help them a great deal towards the end, so that your bag doesn't get stuck in a hub city. You do not want to have to come and get your bag. You'll probably miss your connecting flight if that happens. So make sure they connect, send it to your final destination. Make sure your name tag is on it. And another, just FYI, put something bold and colorful on your bag. Um, just even if you put it on the airplane itself, like if you carry it on, I have seen so many times that somebody's picked up the wrong bag because guess what? They all look alike. So if you're in the market for a new bag, buy something different, buy something colorful. If you have an old bag that you're using, make sure you put on you know, a ribbon, a, a scarf, just something that makes a, a person look twice and, oh wait, that's not my bag. Make sure you have your name to, on it. Uh, the other day I had a guy who picked up the wrong bag. The bag that was left over had no name on it, so we didn't know who it was. It was such a mess. Um, and it happens. It happens more than you think. You know, we've made announcements, made announcements, please, somebody that picked up the wrong bag, but you know, it's just a problem. So gate checked bags every day at the airport. We see it. Um, if it's really important to you that you carry on your bag, that you've got something super important in, in it, pay to go on an earlier group calling. That is something that most major airlines will offer either when you book the ticket or when you get to the airport. It'll say, do you want an earlier boarding group? That will save you uh, possibly from having to gate check. If you're buying a basic economy ticket, you're going to be in the last group no matter what. Um, that's just part of the ticket. So just kind of keep those things in mind uh, with your bags and um, just kind of want to go over that. And when I, by the way, it took them three days to get my bag to me because I, I asked them to deliver it. Uh, I was home, not a major deal, but if you are coming into a, one, a big airport and you really need your bag, go pick it up. Don't wait for them to deliver it. Guys, they don't have enough people to deliver bags. It's just a fact. It's just what's going on right now. There's just not enough people. The poor delivery guy, wasn't his fault. The airlines just um, give them too many bags and, and expect them to do too much trying to deliver in a big metropolitan area. It's, it's kind of crazy. So if you really need your bag or you're on vacation, I would have been so upset if I was on vacation. For me, I was home, dirty clothes, okay. But if I was on vacation, I had no clothes, it's worth it to go back to the airport and pick it up yourself. Even if you send it into the airline and go, hey, give me back my money. This is how much it cost me to go back to the airport. Or especially if you paid for it. If you had to pay for your bag and you didn't receive your bag, you should get your bag fee back. So just FYI, um, just something I wanted to talk to you guys about. My name is Karen. I'm with iFlyRight.net. I am a seasoned airport agent, and uh, I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.